That kills some people. And because it kills some people, I should get some extra attacks here, right? So at least we can kill the army there. Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today I wanted to play more Defend the Rook. And last episode, if you didn't see that, definitely want to check that out because we learned how to play the game, got through the mountains and the Icelands, uh, and now we are on our way to the Mushroom Glade. So uh, this was the one with the hazardous ecosystem that's going to explode on death. Uh, we've already kind of done all of our leveling up and everything we did last episode, so we just uh, are going to be starting our battle here, the third out of five battles. What is this? Why are the mushroom kin leaving their caverns and raising arms? Their my my mycelium spreads all across these lands. They can sense its goings better than anything else. Disgusting. Notice the way they respond to us. Have they truly turned hostile towards civilization? Like pulling weeds, Magister, we must do what we can for the garden to thrive. These aren't weeds, your grace, and saying that the glade cannot be left to threaten the people. Okay. So. Oh. Okay, well, I feel like our chain lightning is going to be pretty good here. Um, okay, so first of all, we're going to do our um, emerald tower, the short range one, just right in the middle there. We're going to put a mid range one probably just in the middle there. And then we're going to put the cannon tower long range one here in the middle as well. But this cannon one, I think we want to have it to the armor. Because this one, I have it hitting people. Yeah, completely remove the armor of enemies destroyed. So whoever has the most armor, that's who I want um, you attacking here. Um, and yeah, so let's let's see here. So we could have you attack. Um, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Kill freaking three people here. Oh my gosh. That's insane. Okay, um, can we just go ahead and have... Where's our rook? Can that attack anything? It can... No, I don't think... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Okay, it can. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know how, how much health does that have? Nine? Um, okay. So we're going to have... We're going to give a little bit of movement. I don't know if I should be wasting this this early on, but I kind of want to clear everything so my... Um, my towers don't take... Oh, whoa. Did that blow up when it died? It dies upon attacking. I don't know what that was just there. I don't know what that was just there. We're going to just have you wait there. Yeah. Okay, so it attacked the thing. That sucks. Um, the sorcerers gains four temporary armor each time they attack. The rogue gains one temporary armor every square they move. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and just freeze trap one of them, I guess. I don't want to waste too many of my freeze traps. And then I'm going to do one barrel. And we'll kind of just get people in position here, I think. We'll get people in position here. We're going to have him move there. That way he can, you know, give them all. Oh, wait, what? One of them spawned here. Okay, well, we have, uh... Just kill literally, like, everyone. Oh my gosh. Chain lightning is sick. That is sick. Um, okay, we'll have you go kill that. Okay, yeah, some of them are... Some of them are definitely, uh... Definitely blowing up when they die. Okay, we'll just end our turn here. I don't think we're gonna be able to kill... Oh, we just have a... I don't think I'm going to be able to get to you. Oh, there, never mind. Easy. Got a lot of range there. Easy peasy. Uh, when a low tier spell is cast, the sorceress gains two temporary armor, two temporary power. The rogues attacks against enemies with less armor than them deal eight damage. After you attack, an enemy gain temporary armor equal to... I'm just going to buff her up, I guess. Um, And we will just end our turn here. Okay, so now they're going to be over here. So can I have you... Can I have him rearm this? How do I rearm it? At the end of your turn, if the rogue is on a disabled trap... Okay, so we'll just have you there, I guess. Um, we're going to do... We'll, we'll save the barrels here. Honestly, we're going to save kind of everything. Um, I will decimate 
for some traps there and there. I don't know if that's actually going to help me, but we'll move a little bit more in position here. And we will... Wish I had more movement here, but we'll, we'll save the movement for the next one, I guess. Oh, what are these? So this thing is, upon death, explode for 10 damage to adjacent units. And then these things are blowing up for 5. Okay, well, first of all... Um, yeah, let's do that. Get a bunch of that chain lightning. Then can I have this rook thing? I cannot. Okay. Huh. This is actually kind of scary here. Um, let's go ahead and do a freeze trap right there. Maybe I should have put it on. Yeah, I... I probably... Or is that an elite? Uh, it's No, it's not an elite. Okay. Um, I can go in and hit a little bit. This is this is gonna be rough. This is gonna be rough. I understand this. Um, let's move this tower a little bit more over here. Oh, okay, nice. It hit the frost. Okay. Um, what we do? Ten damage there. Can the Rook even attack? Come on, help us here. Rook can attack there, nice. Okay, we finished that off. He's obviously taking some damage. Okay, guy's taking a lot of damage. I maybe should have tried to get people out of the way, but that's okay. Uh, the Sorceress also attacks plus one other target in range whenever they attack. Oh my gosh, yes. Once again, I just want to keep on going on the, uh, the Sorcerer. That seems to be the play, so... Oh, nice. We rearmed that trap. I like that. We'll go ahead and move the um, move him here just to kind of get that trap uh, good. We will move her there and then move him there. Kind of buff up some of the armor, I guess. Maybe we should have placed another trap. I don't know. This is this is actually kind of spooky here. Um. Uh, okay, let's start clearing over here. Percher prioritizes moving to an empty block tile. Um, let's see, can we have the... Yikes. Okay, well, we can kill this guy. We can shoot that thing. Um, we can attack this. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and... You know what? No, I, I'm not going to... Uh... Oh, man. I'm gonna decimate this just in case they step on that. Um, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna barrel. I'm gonna barrel one right here so they're not attacking my rogue. Because my rogue's gonna hurt if they're attacking that. Oh, our rook's taking some damage. Those barrels helping us a lot here. Okay. Let's just try to kill this thing here. Would the Rook thing kill that? It wouldn't. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I guess we'll have you attack there. I guess we'll... Oh man, I don't want to... You know what? No, I can't... I can't let that guy do the 10 damage explosion shenanigan. I just can't. So hopefully the towers will kill it gonna there we go okay um yeah kill that and then we're gonna hit that i could kill that but it's gonna hurt my rogue um just end the turn i guess oh then he's gonna hit anyways oh yikes he almost died if he had actually gotten killed there Yeah, I don't know. I need a heal. Your chain lightning now deals two damage to enemies. Yeah, let's do... I'll restore 14 health on him. Yeah, I need to do that. I wish it was on our rogue here, but... I don't know the consequences of dying, so... Um... 
So this is this is only wave four out of five. Oh man. Okay, we'll just and actually I should have brought my closer. What is this? Oh, great mother elite. At the end of your turn, restore five health to all allies and summon two sporlings. Okay. Well then. Um, yeah, let's try to kill that elite here. Um, is this going to die when it? No. Okay. So let's let's just do this. Yeah. This guy's probably maybe. Ah, no, he got a kill, so it should be okay. Um, we're gonna go over here, start doing some damage over here. Gonna have this rook start doing damage over there. Kind of in a little bit of a cruelest place, but we can't. Oh, oh, oh! Yikes. Okay. Okay. Um, 16 damage. Let's go ahead and give him movement speed. To come here. Um. That would kill that guy. I think, th was this guy dead? Oh my gosh. I think, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to armor up. Definitely gonna have to armor up. Oh no, it killed. Oh, I don't know how I did that, but a rogue died. So rip. A rogue died. That's not good. I don't know if we get them back. I don't know how this works. Because is that when this thing dies, it's exploding for ten. Gonna kill all these freaking towers. Whatever. I mean, we gotta do it. Oh, revive the hero with four health. Um, sorceress can now move to any free tile on the board, but you can no longer gain armor. That's kind of scary. Let's revive our rogue here. Even if it's only for four health. We'll go ahead and bring him there so he can give you guys some uh, armor. Okay, boss wave. Here we go. We'll go ahead and freeze it there. And uh, we're going to kind of start getting our peeps into position here. Okay. Oh. 200 plus 3 damage. Immune to player damage at the start of your turn. Spawn. Wait, what? Immune to player damage at the start of your turn. Spawn the fungal rook in the middle nine tiles and remove this unit. What? So we can't do any damage to it? So it's going to just spawn there? What? Okay, well in this case... What? I guess we... Try to just get the armor up here? I don't really know... Oh! Oh! Um... At the start of your turn, attack 9,000 a square alternating... Okay. So we need to, it's going to attack, what, the four things here? That's interesting. Okay. So we just got to get out of that, right? Wait a minute. Okay, yeah, so it's attacking the four corners, right? Nine tiles and a square alternating each round between adjacent and diagonal areas. Okay, yeah, so here, like, we can... We can... Why can't I? Oh, no, I did not mean to. Ah! Um, I did not mean to do that here. There's some damage. Why can't I attack in certain... What? Why can't I attack? I don't understand why I can't attack, um... It with melee. I don't quite understand. But, huh, can I, I mean, our, I guess our rook can do it. I probably should have moved our rook, but whatever. So now it's gonna summon all those people. So now we gotta move them again, which I could move. Okay, let's move right here. And then attack those. And then we will move this and we'll 
fire there. We will go ahead and move there. And I can't attack melee for some reason. That's just not a thing that I'm allowed to do. And I don't I don't quite understand why. Um, takes up more than one tile, cannot be moved or be moved. Yeah, I, I get that, but I don't... Hmm, okay. Oh, I should have moved my guy. I forgot about that. Yeah. This is getting a little scary here. Um, okay, we'll move you here. Just keep attacking. All that chain lightning. It's... I don't... I don't... Oh, now I can... What? Now I can attack it? Also, did our rogue die? I think our rogue died. We gotta just keep hitting this thing. Uh, let's give... Oh no, oh no, I messed that up. Cause our rook's taking damage. Can I... Nope, okay. How much damage are you doing, 10? Oh man, did I, I just threw, didn't I? And I can't undo my turn. Oh, okay. Did we just lose? Okay, it's at two health, we got this. We got this. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Um, okay, we're gonna move him all the way back here. Move him all the way back here. Kill that. Um, okay. So we need to move you right here. And then we can kill those two. Do a little bit of damage there. Like to see it. We'll move that. And I guess just wait. Um, okay. Ooh, those spoilings. Okay. Okay, so we just gotta move this thing here. And I guess we gotta just make sure this thing's dead, right? I hate that we have to take the damage, but. Just gotta make, I mean, our Rook, we don't have time to play around here, so. Oh, I should have done the far one, because now it's not gonna, oh, there we go, okay, cool. Um, and then we're okay. Except our main hero there. Okay. So we gotta move. And. Oh! I don't, ah, uh, okay. I don't really understand how this works fully sometimes, but that's okay. Um, okay, we're gonna go here. And we'll attack. It's got one health here, can we? Okay, here we go, movement time. Okay, att let me attack, how did, there we go. We did it! I don't know what, what the, penalty for losing our rogue was oh there he is um plus two move plus one range and agile can move through Ooh, the rogue oh so these are rare the rogue can move through enemy units and dealing the rogue power is damaged to them the first on the warrior destroys enemy each round the warrior gains another turn uh that's pretty good but let's give phasing i want her to be able to i she's she is our main person right now 100 percent magister you cannot be so foolish as to support the golden queen in her conquest how is she controlling you stop spouting nonsense you speak of her conquest yet what of yours you're the ones who spread into occupied lands uh then you were deceived oh, oh noble mage we do not spread you take from us our body our soul will be stained in gold and the gems beneath us will be hers gems she has plenty of gems of her own why would why wouldn't she know a queen with gems to achieve, with the gems to achieve anything she desires. A je dangerous burning light. All will wither. All will. My rook, my hair is my power. Used to butcher the queen which dealt our end. We ask you with your powers, stop her. That traitor is scum. Dare she insult me like this? My noble magic used for evil ends. I will make her pay. The queen shall fall. I'm not fully understanding the plot of the game, but that's okay. That's okay. So now we got the desert. Gold Army Commander. Disciplined in their devotion to the Queen, they are given the finest utilities of warfare, a true army. Overwhelming as an army, but as a lone soldier, uh, can often be vulnerable. The Queen has betrayed me. You've defeated her oppositions and amassed her gem supply. The Queen's Golden Army serves as her uh, devout protectors. Deal with them and the Queen will be vulnerable. Correct your mistake, Magister. Put an end to the conquest you helped create. So first of all, we can level up. We have 161. Final one is increased damage radius by one. So we're going to go that. I mean... 
that's like the final thing of what we're really trying to do here. Um, when attacked, the attacker takes three damage or just, yeah, let's just actually heal two health each wave. Let's get more max health and then we'll do just extra armor so you don't die. Okay, so there's all the level ups. Now we can do the shops here. Um... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and get our rook some armor here, um, because that got a little scary and I don't want to throw. Um, if there's no enemy, oh yeah, if there's no enemy, we we got to that. Um, uh, your tower attacks remove all armor from the target before damage. Ooh, gain an additional trap to place. Yeah, let's let's get the um it removes the armor before. Oh, attacks hit all arm all things in range. That's sick. So now that thing is attacking, attacks hit all enemies in the range. Um uh sort of your turn, your barricade suffers for it. Um And then other than that, honestly, let's just go ahead and um cuz I don't think there's anything super super meaningful. Um, so I'm going to just go ahead and buff up the health and then your rook heals one after each wave. Give it more max health. I don't want to accidentally, um, you know, throw here just because we got really close. What our thing had like, no, uh, <laughs> our rook almost died there and the run was almost over. So I probably want to help that. Magisters, you're, the apologies were getting tiresome. I'm glad to be free of the ruse. You've outlived your usefulness to me. I will have your head for this. My heroes will gladly strike you down for disgracing their legacy. Please, with the gems, my forces are more powerful than you could possibly imagine. It wouldn't be the first time I have brought down a kingdom. They will see reason or they will fall with you, your grace. Okay, here we go. Now everyone's back to full HP, which is obviously nice. So, uh, let's go ahead and do... Um, the chain tower, this is hitting literally everything. Um, so we're gonna go put it there. We'll put the medium one here. And maybe I should have done that in a different way, but emerald tower over there, I guess. Okay. Well, first of all, we can just, uh, what, do a sane... Uh, first of all, let's look at what they're doing. Okay, they're just stats. Um, elusive agile, can move through units. Okay. And then he's prioritizing, what, attacking the furthest distance possible. So we're going to just do a stupid amount of damage there to literally everyone. I mean, this chain lightning thing is crazy. This chain lightning thing is crazy. Um, I can't really move very far, can I? Uh, let's go ahead and get some early movement here. Uh, that way they prioritize that. Um, and I don't really feel the need to barrel yet. I don't, f oh, that's a lot of damage they're doing. Maybe we'll do a barrel right there. Distract them a little bit. What, who do I, who are I, oh, I can move barrels? That's interesting. Okay, yeah, attack that barrel. Sucks we already lost one of our two barrels, but... Um, yeah, just get out of here. The sorceress can attack adjacent enemies. The rogue gains one temporary armor every square they move. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Um, sweet. Okay, new wave incoming. We'll, yeah, have you just kind of go there. We'll have you go over there. And we need him to start making his way over here as well. Uh, we'll have, I want my rook to kind of be in the middle, I think. Oh, easy. Um, okay, just do a stupid amount of damage there. Uh, rook, finish that off there for us. Finish that off. Easy peasy. Um, when chain lightning occurs, arcane towers gain plus one temporary power. Um, when the rogue moves over a trap, rearm it. Okay, let's do that. 
I don't know. I mean, we haven't placed any traps yet, but... Um, I'll go ahead and start placing some traps. I'll decimate there. I'll decimate there. Um, I don't feel the need to do freeze traps yet. Um, okay, we're gonna move her over here. Him. Uh, probably somewhere there. Rogue somewhere here. We'll just kind of see how that plays out. Oh, that's a cannon. These things are elites. Oh, there's a lot of cannons here. What is this? Uh, at the start of the round, takes aim in a straight line. At the end of the round, it shoots all tiles in the line and then moves six to one edge of the board. So it's going to fire down here. That's fine with this. This is going to fire that way. This is going to fire that way. Well, first of all, let's do a crap ton of damage. Um, then we can... Let's move you there, and then yeah. that. So you're gonna shoot there, you're gonna, sh oh, that's hitting our cannon tower. Can't really do much about that. Um, I can't even kill it. It gets so close though. Can I, can I freeze trap on top of something? No, I can't. Oh, this thing's hitting, oh, snap. Hmm, yeah, that's not good. Um, okay, you know what? We're going to have him actually tank some damage here for us. I think is what we're going to do here. Um, yeah, screw it. I hate to waste that already. I hate to waste that already. I just don't... We can't have our towers. Oh, it goes through. I couldn't even protect. Oh, that was kind of pointless then, wasn't it? It's kind of pointless. Um, okay. Oh, I don't think we attacked with the Rook, did we? Um, okay, we need to finish that. This is not attacking anything. This is hitting our Rook, which I didn't think about. Man, I'm... I'm, uh, yeah, not, not being the smartest here. Okay, eight damage. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Okay. Do that. Do that. Do that. Uh, if the sorceress destroys an enemy, they gain four power and one range next round. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just keep buffing her up. Um, I guess we'll just kind of move close to that trap. So what, we're on wave three out of five here. Um, okay, here we go. I'm actually going to do some ice traps now. Now that I can rearm them. Okay, so this is a golden juggernaut, cannot move her to, oh yeah, it's stunned. Okay. This is another one of those archers. Yeah, we can just between that and then the rook there. We use this guy there. And we'll just, I kind of want to kill that. Interdimensional thief. It's all we can really do. Um. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Okay then, sir. Whatever, uh... Whatever you're wanting to do there. Oh, it's gonna do a lot of damage here. So we're gonna barrel. It's barrel time. Oh, wait, I didn't even need to do that. I forgot I still had an attack there. Oh, yeah, I forgot I get more attacks here. When a low-tier spell is cast. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do more movement on our rogue there. And the turn. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and uh, rearm that. Oh, no, that didn't even... Wait, let me cancel that. Let me get some movement here. This is what I want. I want you to do that, and then I want you to... Land there. What? Can I not 
do the specific path I want? What? That's lame. I can't... What? What? Why does that... Okay, I gotta check in the settings or something. There's gotta be a setting, right? There's gotta be a setting. Man, that's that's kind of lame, honestly. If I can't do the rearm thing and then keep moving. Why, why can't I move the way I want? I should have a limited amount of... I. It shouldn't be you have one move. It should be you can move this many spaces. Cause that's that's kind of that's kind of obnoxious. I can't even. I'm trying to like set like a path or something. I mean, I guess we still do that. That's just it's kind of lame. Um. Okay, we'll go ahead and do a freeze trap over there and kind of just get ready. And then we will have this guy start coming over here. Call it a day. This this cannon tower here's gonna die here soon luckily though look at this though this is gonna be pretty good uh, look how much damage this is about to do that's pretty I didn't kill anyone though maybe I should have killed someone so um, what it would have actually continued happening maybe oh this is an immortal commander here okay he's got a barrel though so well, let's let's go ahead and try to Focus on that. Focus on that. Is she? Oh man, we might we might actually be in trouble here. We might be in trouble here. Um, let me go ahead and do a decimate trap right there. Yeah, we might be in trouble here. We might be in trouble. Oh, there goes that tower. They're gonna attack my. Uh, oh, they're. Oh. Okay, well, luckily here, this probably now kills, like, everyone, right? Oh, well, the towers themselves are going crazy here. Um, okay. There we go, okay. Boom, boom, boom. So, can I attack again? I can! That's so good, okay. Just damage. 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 And turn. Oh, our rogue is almost dead here. But I mean, we should have it, so. Wait, it comes back to life? Wait, 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 wait a minute. What? What's going on here? Yeah, we're still killing it. There we go. Okay. Um, killing enemy makes some explode dealing five damage. Yeah, let's do that. I, as much as I want more health on the rogue. Okay, we got our last wave here. Boss wave. I have no more traps I can place. So let's just start getting people in position here. Start getting people in position. They're all lining up for me though. Which is good. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go ahead. That kills some people. And because it kills some people, I should get some extra attacks here, right? So at least we can kill the army there. Um, okay, we need some movement here. Actually, can you finish off? You cannot, because you're lame. You're lame. Oh, I can't have anyone finish this off, actually. Okay, we're going to do this so they maybe attack the rogue instead. Um. Huh. Yeah, this is. Oh, there's still a guy over there. <laughs> I forgot about him. Hopefully, he will be killed by the things. No. Um. Okay. We need to do damage to the boss. The boss will die. Oh, sweet, sweet, dude. This mage thing here. Pretty lit. Ton of damage there. Ton of damage there. Let's have our rook start dealing damage. Okay. Oh yeah, please hit. Please hit that guy. Please hit that guy. Uh, damage. And then we damage. 
No, we damage. Hit. Oh. Oh. Oh, he killed my rogue. Okay. Well. That's fine. I think we just still focus on this. I think I'm going to do the move just to power up this person's attack. All we got to do is finish this person there. That killed. Oh my gosh. Killed. So we get another attack. Do that. Easy. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Let's have our sorceress there. Let's go. Let's go. Easy. Dude, this sorceress is insane. Increase the radius of chain lightning by one. That's what we're doing. <laughs> That's what we're doing. I mean, we're putting all our eggs in the sorceress basket. Your army is broken. I will stain these stain sands red if you continue to force my hand. Surrender yourself and that will be the end of it. My dear Magister, you have just attacked a sovereign kingdom. What else should my soldiers do but defend their ruler? Our business is already concluded, which makes this needless violence uh, fall back. Do not play coy with me. You twist loyalty into obsession, and their blood is woven into your lies. Come and face me now, Jezebel. Continue. That sounds like a slur. <laughs> Continue to flee, and I will come for you. Okay, so we're at the volcanic peak is the last one here. Strengths, master of all, weaknesses, none. You've defeated the queen's defenses and have chased her into the fiery mountains of volcanic peak. She has nowhere to run. As you enter, you feel familiar energy, a dark energy. Send this insidious demon back to the abyss it spawned from Magister. Okay, well, um, at the end of your turn, give your adjacent heroes temporary armor equal to half your armor. Yeah, let's do that. And let's, we'll get some armor. Oh, I can't actually even do that. I don't have the... The, the experience for that, so just get some range, I guess. Um, okay, well, we can't use anything for that, but we can here in our shop. What is this? Your rook gains an ore that gives allies in a fortile radius plus three temporary power. Let's go ahead and get to that. Um, let's see. If the Emerald Tower destroys an enemy last turn, it gains three temporary radius. Um, you know, that's pretty good. Let's, let's get to that. Um... Let's see, do we get more barrels? <laughs> um, I mean, max health on the barrels is pretty good. When the cannon tower attacks on me, the rogue deals his power to the same. Uh, e if the cannon, yeah, let's start doing this. If the cannon tower is destroyed, get an additional trap, and then we'll go all the way to um, when it attacks, the rogue deals his power, even though our rogue's not crazy good. Um, and we only have, so we'll just get health on the barrels. Uh, we could get the final one, but that's okay. Okay, let's do this. I'm assuming this is just a boss battle here, so I wonder how many waves are going to be here. I told you I was coming. Nothing will protect you from me. I'm giving you one last chance to... You, disgusting creature, what have you done with her? Ha, you are careless, dear conjurer. You presume to have destroyed my body, warding off my return by another century, but you have always underestimated my cunning. The queen's ambition was boundless, and in it I secured a means of permanence. No doubt she sought for me what I had gained from her powerful ascension. Here, my genius, Magister, the queen needed a pawn to pave the way uh, to an opposed rule. She needed you. My fake invasion was too good of an offer for her to resist, and you happen to be Magister for a hire. A scheme to fool even the great lord of the rook. Speak. What say you now? I am Azaz, lord of... Are you done? Because I am. I've had a long campaign, more than I ever bargained for. I will ensure you never return to this realm. This time, I will watch carefully as you crumble to nothing. You will regret taking me so lightly in your arrogance. I am renewed. Let us see how you're fair against my new power. So we still have five waves. We still have five waves. Okay. Um, so we're going to go arcane tower, medium range. We'll put that there. Um, we'll do long range load damage. We'll do that there. And we'll do the short range one. Pro Maybe I should be doing the short range one in the middle. I don't know. We'll do that there. Okay, so, I mean, we could probably, yeah, you just easily kill both of them. I mean, the chain lightning I have going for me right now is absurd. Um, when a trap is triggered, the rogue gains 10 temporary power. If the warrior takes health damage, when a trap's triggered, I guess we'll just do that. I'm going to move this thing up, and then he's going to give them all, or a lot of them, armor. Okay. Um, let's just do one freeze trap. Maybe I should have done it uh, high up. Um, honestly, I'm going to move him up, and then everything else can kind of stay where they're at. 
Easy, dude. I mean... Oh, yeah, it attacks all enemies in the radius. Okay, so now we just chain lightning. We get some kills, which means we get another attack. I mean, this is... This is crazy. <laughs> this is insane! We'll go have the rogue finish off the... What we started here. Four power, one next to another allied unit. Um, the rogue... Yeah, I guess we'll do that. Um, we'll just end our turn. I want him to... So we're going to have him go there, rearm that trap, even though that's not for the best. We'll go ahead and do another freeze trap right here. So that way he can just keep rearming those. Um, and then we'll just end our turn. Man, our towers are crazy now. Especially attacking everyone. Like, okay, so now we will just have you kill literally every single person on the field. Oh my gosh. Chain lightning is so freaking strong. I kill all of that. I kill all of that. Oh my gosh. So then, yeah, just go ahead and rearm that. Whatever. Um, uh, would movement even be able to get me there? I would need one, two, three extra movement. Um, that does suck. That does suck. So I'm actually going to place a barrel for the first time. Actually, you know what? No, no, no. I can, I can take some damage. I can take some damage here. I can take some damage here. Um, we will move you a little bit closer though. Oh, it didn't attack anything. Easy. Oh, and it got buffed now. Minus one move, but two range. Um, if the rogue didn't attack this turn. Yeah, we'll just do... Minus one move to range. Uh, we're gonna move you just closer there so you buff up everyone else's stuff. Um, uh, I think we're just gonna end the turn. The fact that we're destroying their armor too is just so, so good. Um, okay, we will do this because that's a, uh, a kill. And then can we now... There we go. This rook should be able to kill that. Um, now we're going to actually use the movement here. Bam. And then we're going to finish that guy off. And then there's a single wolf here left, which let me place a trap thing right there. Oh, nice. It actually hit, but oh, wow. It still hit our rook. Okay. It died, but... Um, four power, one next to another allied unit. Four temporary power and four temporary when adjacent enemy is destroyed. Yeah, that sounds okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and place a single barrel. No, 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 no. I actually think I can wait. We'll go ahead and move him up, though. And we're going to move him just right there to buff up. Oh, okay. Spicy people here. That we got chain lightning. So that's a gem demon. What are gem demons? Cannot move. Okay. Charges. Flying demon. Okay. So can I kill anyone? That's always the priority. Can I kill anyone here? Okay. Yeah. As long as I can kill one person, that gives me another attack. Um, then we're going to attack again here. I mean, this is amazing. Um, finish that off. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get some movement here. Probably should be... Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Um, nine damage I can take. I want to save the barrels... Um, for when I actually need them. That's amazing. I mean, our sorcerer is insane. When a mid-tier spell is cast, the sorcerer gains four move. When a rogue attacks an elite or boss, they deal an additional ten damage. Yep. Elite slayer. That's good. That's good. Um, we're going to bring everyone kind of close back. Get some armor. Okay, boss wave here, so we're going to freeze trap, at least on there, um, and we will get people in position here.
Everyone, okay, we got a line here waiting. And then we're gonna move this up one. Here we go. Got an achievement, Master Engineer. Also, doing an insane amount of damage. Have a tower deal over 25 damage in a single attack. Okay, what are we looking at here? So I know I'm covering some of this, but um, slams units close to him. If you, no units are nearby, um, breathes fire on faraway enemies, disappears after losing 100 health. Oh, wow. What a lame -o. Um, Okay, yeah, well. So what is he? he? His attack is hitting all of that. Oh, that's no fire. That's hitting, like, everything. Whatever. Maybe we can maybe we can do enough damage here. Um Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Did our rogue die? Oh no, he's right there. I was like, excuse me. Why okay. Why are we having trouble hitting people here? Is what what space is he technically on? I'm so confused at what space he's actually on here. Do I need movement? Is that what I'm needing here? Why can't... Why can't I attack you? Whatever, at least doing this protects our, uh... That's kind of lame. I don't understand why I can't. Um, okay. Well, wool, stone plate. Yeah, whatever. Oh, wait, I could... I don't I don't understand. I'm having such a hard time attacking bosses here. Oh, well he was untouchable. That's what was going on there. That's what was going on here. Okay, well just kill all these units here because it's easy. Um and then we're just gonna keep attacking. I'll do one attack on that. Oh, that's where he disappears. Okay. That's where he's disappearing too. Okay. Uh, we'll place a single barrel down there. I actually probably need to... Oh, no, you can't move them. I don't understand. Okay. Okay, I'm fine with lots of enemies. That that works for my sorcerer thing here. Because I'll just do one attack, because it's pretty much like a free attack. One attack that will kill literally all of these enemies. And then... Um, uh, I'll just do a spell just to buff her up because I think that's maybe no, it's not how that works. Okay, whatever um, 104 Yeah, let's kill both and then do a little bit of damage That's sick and then we do stupid amount of damage. You're at 61. You're gonna hide because you're lame <laughs> This is dude our sorcerer is insane Chain lightning is freaking OP y'all Chain lightning is freaking OP Oh my, even the tower is hitting everything now. That's pretty sick. Okay, can we finish it here? Let's see. We can. Let's go. Let's go. It's got two more achievements as well. <laughs> we did it. No, why is this happening? But I outwitted you. How? Be gone and you will no longer nuisance, uh, be a nuisance this realm. No, with this power I can accomplish even what you cannot. I will be different this time. I will be with you again soon. Aftermath, you your would-be rival erupts into a blinding light and disappears from the board uh, before you exhale heavily and take the time to consider his final words. Likely a desperate threat. The warning means little from a demon who will not material again for a long, long time. Before you can turn your thoughts, uh, you turn your thoughts to the lives that were lost. You experience sudden head pain, foreboding. You realize that your fight may not be over just yet. Before you turn in, resolving to rectify the realm once you wake to a new dream. Continue. You feel that something has changed within the realm here. So what is this? So we can get some um, upgrades here. Um, contraptions. Unlocks the proximity mine. Ooh. Unlock some new spells here. Yeah, well, okay. You know what? Unlock two additional spell packs to choose from the start of your run. We'll get one of those. We'll get one of those. Um, let's get an upgraded samurai. So, okay. We get, so that's what the gemstones do here for us. So we'll go back. A lot of out-of-game progression here. So now spell loadout. So now we can choose one of the groups of spells here uh, for the next run. That's interesting. You can also choose, um, oh, there's ascension level. So the next one would be reduced heal. Um, that's interesting. Um, and it unlocks three towers. Oh, so the ascension levels are the ones that um, do that type of stuff. 
We got our unit loadout, our, um, you know, different uh, kind of things and stuff like that. So this game's got a lot of meat uh, to the bones, a lot of progression, a lot of reason to keep playing and stuff like that. So holy cow, I'm glad we were able to get a W Sorcerer with the chain lighting. Definitely OP. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, you know, let me know if you want to see us do a new campaign of Defend the Rook. But at the very least, I'm really, really happy that we were able to finish the campaign and see what the out-of-game progression looks like and stuff like that. So, um, you know, hope you guys enjoyed consider subscribing and ringing that bell like all the big boy youtubers say to be notified uh, if more defend the rook videos come out or just all the other awesome content we cover on the channel uh and um if uh, you're gonna be grinding out some defend the rook on your own then i wish you guys luck and see you all next time